All right, David, good morning. KC5GTT here. I figured I'd give you a little video of your amplifier while uh, we're waiting on your cover, which ought to be through today, by the way. Uh, got your metering, plate voltage, plate current, operation lights, and warm up light, and transmit light. Uh, normally, the warm up light will glow red until it warms up. And then the, to keep the transmit lights a nice, nice blue. Tune knob. A tube. Can't get a real good shot of it there. And over here, you got your bias relay and your bias uh, diode. There's your TR relay. Whoops. And then right here is your. Uh, antenna load, which I really doubt you'll have to readjust, but if you do, that's where it's at. Unless you have some kind of really weird uh, match on your antenna or something, that's normally not not adjusted again. Anyway, here's your antenna. Radio is an ICOM 910H. I have it in CW. Here's the meter. It's a CN1 or CN801 HP. Let me give a little little run at it here. Right there, about 1100 watts. Right at about 1200. These numbers are a little bit low. I've got low line voltage here, so I never really get to see the full potential of the amps I build, which is kind of a bummer. All right, let me put it on the FM here. There you go, about 1250. Yeah, let's see if we can get a little more out of it. Change hands here. Yeah, about 1250. That's all I was wanting to do this morning. Switch to single side fan. Oop, CW. There we go. KC5GTT test. One, two, test. KC5 GTT. Anyway, there's a there's an idea of what it's doing. Got a good match on the input. Let's see if we can see the metering here. Uh, let's see. KC5 GTT. Okay. Getting full scale there. That's a uh, you know it's not holding back anything. But anyway, there you go. There's your new amplifier. Hope you enjoy it.